Hey guys, my name is Logan and or Frost and welcome back to Fortnite. Um, no, do, do not do that. <laughs> Shit. Um, anyways, welcome back to Fortnite, guys. Last time we actually had to run around and do these things called siphon missions. Here is the dialogue chain that is extremely weird. Um, and that's what we get when we... Why? Why am I... Nope. Back out of there. It's like, hey, do you want to do this level 50 mission? No. <laughs> Game, I really don't. Considering I'm level 24. Anyways, last time, we ended up having to do one of the siphon missions. Um, I did luck out and just got lucky with people doing the same mission as me. It is kind of difficult to dissuade people to help you. Like I also mentioned, it's people get dead set into what they're doing, which is completely fair. Um, like, they're like, hey, I'm doing this mission to get resources. I'm not going to help you do the siphon mission, which y you need help. <laughs> you need help doing it. Um, at least for me, I'm not at the, like, the god tier level of doing that. Maybe when I rank up my soldier and she has a minigun, maybe. But even then, the, it's spread out, right? So, like, you, that's the problem. Anyways, not the point. Uh, the point is, is that we did it. <laughs> um, and here's the dialogue cue of what happens when we complete it. It's pretty interesting. It's, a nef it's the next little bit of the story. Siphon test success. Now to start the enrichment process. This next stage could potentially ignite a gray goo situation, or reverse gravity, or cause that thing where it rains sulfur and all rivers burn for a thousand years. So, for the next few days, I suggest living like there's no tomorrow! Commander. This is Ray. And not any of the other bots. You need to go to the encampments. And touch the encampments. Don't bring bullets. They are bad luck. Listen to me. I am wise. Yeah, so that was totally Ray, right, dude? <laughs> of course. Oh, by the way, we are also named Grin now. Um, I'm doing this for all the videos I'm filming this week, which may be scattered and coming out at all times. Link in the description um, for me explaining why our name is now Grin. That link will take you to a Let's Talk where I went on about it. Um, and yeah, I don't have the banner yet for the channel. Maybe I do by the time this comes out, although probably not. Also, look at this shit. That's not cool. Maybe you guys can't see it. Probably can. It's like a zit. <laughs> it's like, guess what? I'm like three fathoms deep, bitch. <laughs> you don't even know what's about to happen. It's like, ah. But the next mission is asking us to do something completely and utterly reasonable. I miss these missions, <laughs> or these objectives. Complete and destroy two mission encampments at a level 3 range. Luckily, um, there is a level 23 encampment that is in my bracket, which is kind of shitty because... That's what I don't like is sometimes it promotes, sometimes you cannot complete the quest that day because the right rotation is not there. Sometimes. Sometimes they're there, sometimes they're not. Um, or if it is, it's like, guess what, you gotta do a level like 50 equivalent or something. And I'm like, I'll die immediately. <laughs> can we not? Um, I can't wait to where we can actually spend our okay <laughs> amount of money. Keep an eye out for any encampments that look angrier than usual. Yeah, but like Ghost Ray was uh was like a psycho. So why how come you know what's up? Yeah, you can take all that. I don't I only hit like three times. I didn't notice it in time. I was like, what's that crashing? Like this is you hitting a truck or something? Oh no, it's the pinata. <laughs> Shit. By the way, this is way, way stronger. This used to be my strongest weapon, and I think they nerfed it somehow. Um, but no, now this is definitely my strongest weapon, so. Weird how things work. <laughs> Which is kind of great because this one I legitimately had to earn, so I'm happy that it's kind of stronger. Um, oh wait, but we have to find the Pillar of Light, which also works out really well, because the city doesn't have too many tall things. Oh, you found it! On a side note, I, I still really like the game, like, uh, even having played a lot of it, and like, again, I play this game a lot on my free time as well. You kinda have to if you want to progress, at this point it's like, oh great, it's on the other side of the planet. Anyways, um, tank, but okay. Hmm. Ooh, you see, did they change your voice? I didn't sound like British. Take out those husks. I completely forgot. <laughs> I was trying to say what I was going on about. Mowing, 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 mowing everyone down. And the little one gets shot once and then dies. I I was talking about how I really like this game and it's a bit grindy now. Um, oh, right, no, I was just trying to come up with a fucking, like, <laughs> what is it called? The analogy of, like, you. It's like your time has less value the more you play it, almost. It's just weird. Um... It's almost like you should be rewar rewarded for your loyalty, but nah, every free to play game is like, nah, dude. <laughs> the deeper you get in, the more of a sinkhole this is. <laughs> it's like, oh, okay. I mean, alright. <laughs> Actually, I said this gun was uh, not as strong, but I think it is. It's just a, it's a, not an accurate weapon, right? And this is very, very much an accurate weapon. So, did I complete the quest? Because I could have sworn that was the critique. It's like, I could do two encampments and that was it. 
Doesn't mean you gotta do random encampments? No, but this still would count. Like, they, I don't think they'd make that a quest unless you could very specifically, like, target it. Ooh, I don't know why we need these. If you're the kind of person that doesn't beat on this the minute that they are aware of it, I wasn't at the beginning, that's why <laughs> I didn't do it. You are the worst. <laughs> you are the actual worst. Some people are in this and doing the encampments. Most are not. <laughs> but it's like, why come to this objective? There's a thousand other objectives that are better off for doing just resource farming. Like quite literally doing Lars's van, someone will have made the like the fence, and you just have to stick around for a couple minutes after you're done farming your materials, just to get a little more experience and resources. Not resources, but yeah, no resources. You can drop like special shards. That is one thing that pisses me off a little bit. Like these guys, they have the best aim. And that kind of, I don't know, I like another game I am kind of playing a lot of right now, which is Destiny. As much as enemies can get to the point where they're just doing stupid damage to you, you're able to dodge it. So it offers some sort of like skill counter. With those like Cyclops fucking X-Men dudes who are like beaming you in the face, um, there's not a lot you can do. Like they are like laser sight locked onto you, so you're just like, okay, I'm dying in two seconds unless I can get behind a rock or something. Ooh, that gun, dude's gun looks, oh, it's a double barrel, like, dragon gun. Jealous. <laughs> Extremely so, actually. Damn. Ooh, yeah, you need to get the fuck up out of there, dude. Christ. So I guess that's what that one's used for, but yeah, the shock trooper person for the Outlander, I don't think is... The one I would personally choose. <laughs> it seems like the, sh the teddy is w the way to go. Eww. Rally call to everyone who, yeah, wants to have a rally call. <laughs> I don't know. Um, oh, by the way, um, a lot of you guys were asking me about Fortnite and its special uh, new Battle Royale type of uh, PUBG event. Player unknown battleground, PUBG. Um, no one told me what the fuck that meant for the first little bit, so I was like, what are the fuck are people talking about? <laughs> um, I'll take the long way to the right, even though it's probably dumb. Um, I haven't played it yet because it's just not my type of game mode. I don't like games that are hyper, hyper, hyper stressed, and to me, PUBG is, and that's why a lot of people love it. And it also doesn't play to the type of like skill and whatnot that I enjoy, but it does exist. Like, it's definitely difficult to be good at like a PUBG type of game, etc. Um, but it doesn't play to that niche either. Um, but yeah, I've, I've, dude, when I was a kid, I played on like easy and was proud of it. Now I play on normal just because I, I don't want it to be over in, in like two seconds. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I never had a problem with that, that perception. Like, I don't play games to get my teeth kicked in, you know what I mean? I'm not, I don't think, in fact, it pisses me off a lot of times when people are like, I beat Dark Souls and I'm part of the hardcore audience. It's like, alright guy, <laughs> you need to chill out. <laughs> oh, I don't, you can't do that, me. God damn it, you can't, you gotta get close to it or else it resets it. Yep, it's looking pretty grim for me. Yep. Ooh, shite. Whew. That is such an unpleasing swear word. It doesn't even feel good to say. It's just like a panic word for me. You fucker. I was trying to grab it. You fucking soulless husk. A human being. How dare you? How dare you to find me? Oh no. Oh no. Fate's like, oh, you want to be that guy? Great. Look at your cool gun. Is your gun gold? Why is your gun like uh, lightning is yellow? Cause mine is blue, <laughs> so I'm very curious. It's weird. Thanks, Ray. The negative to this weapon is that it just chews through ammo, regardless if you hit your target. Like it's just, eh. <laughs> it just is just. It's supposed to be like a slow firing weapon, but yeah. I have no stamina. Oh, this is where it gets bad. It's really bad. Stop stagger him. Just stagger him. Shit, guys. Christ's life. Christ, but we can't we can't get too far away from it warning you're about to leave the encampment. I know I know I know I'm gonna fucking die Yeah, that and that whoo Christ panic built as you guys would fucking get up on here I'm gonna take a, I'm gonna stay a mile back because that's how that works. No idiot. <laughs> I'm sorry for getting mad at you guys You guys can't hear me, but still it's rude to talk behind people's backs. I am a bear. Oh, oh, by the way, there was an update to the game. Someone was mentioning something like there was like a battle royale. Oh no, a horde mode. Is what you guys are saying? A new horde mode that they're planning on adding, and I cannot. I, I am not sure about that. I kind of been really busy this week and last week, <laughs> so it's just kind of shitty and feel like it's piling on. Uh, nope, you're really bad. You're, thank you guys for saving me. And honestly, it's not really necessary to get all the encampments either. It's just kind of like a, th a thing. <laughs> it's kind of fun, but ultimately not needed. 
Like, I don't, th I don't think we get a gold tier chest or the max tier of chests when we do do it, so. <laughs> I don't really think it's worth it. See, now, this is the best case scenario because I can just wait up here. If I get, like, pretty dang dinged up, I can just, you know, be okay. Nope, you are very bad. Yep. Ooh, so much damage. I do like one of the aspects of that enemy's like makeup, and that is if you shoot them mostly like once in the mouth or the head when they're blasting you, it snaps them out of it completely, which is very cool. But it's not cool when they auto lock on you, because it kind of creates the feeling of okay, no matter what, I'm going to die unless I have a wall in front of me, which that may be the case. Which if that's the case, then maybe you should just build a wall. Is that how you counter them? I don't know. I feel like this game is not that complicated. It sounds shitty, but I feel like the game is isn't that. It's not like, hey, here's this intricate way of doing things. It's like, well, just chill out. <laughs> You'll be fine. Oh shit, there's one per yeah, we have to kill everyone before it resets. Oh no, they all spawn? Good. This is like the best case scenario for a person that plays ranged. <laughs> like, no kidding. Yeah, only one more. Oh, well, maybe we can do this if it's close. That's also the battle, is it, is it a mile away? Yeah, they're using my thing. Haha, <laughs> yeah. I still don't know why people use snipers. <laughs> it just seems redundant a little bit, you know what I mean? Healer! I will heal her with you, but like, I'm gonna do this. <laughs> just so you guys don't rock, like get rocked. Ah, we only need to do one more left. I think, well, right, Reyes said this was the last one. Even though we already got gold. You did it. Yes! And now we get Two minutes, guys, just to fucking do, ow, ow, <laughs> just to go get resources, which, what is the main resource I need? Because my weapons now just chew through ammunition, so that's, it's like, yeah, they're strong, but dude, <laughs> there's like nothing left. They are hungry as fuck as well. <laughs> Honestly, I think a big reason why games like this <laughs> are so fun, games like Destiny, Fortnite, and even to certain degrees, Let It Die. Um, I think those games are perfect and fun because of the next weapon you have. Um, which I guess is something Carl, probably Call of Duty got their hands on first, like unlocking the next weapon and etc. And then it became the next weapon skin and then etc, etc, etc. Just kind of like hyper focusing efficiency because if you don't have to make a weapon, if you can just get a skin for it, it's probably pretty easy to just reskin a gun rather than make a whole new one. But uh, yeah, that's definitely something that I know helps immensely. Like right now, I'm really hoping that I get the super, the legendary hero pack or whatever, and hoping that I I get legendary hero. <laughs> um, is it legendary? Yeah, legendary gold. Um, that's why I'm saving up so much is so that I hopefully can get one character that I can just start pushing experience into, and that'll be it. By the way, I should use my sword more. Like it is solid. Also, she has way more health than my uh, ninja. <laughs> so, yeah. Which is weird. You think the ninja would get health regen on a kill or something, and it stacks slightly because, yeah. But it have to stack up to a lot, like 50, 50 kills in succession. It goes. It starts to tick down bit by bit, um, because. Yeah, it just feels like that'd be kind of like a melee, but also glass cannon, like, playstyle, because you're regenerating the health that you're losing. I don't know. <laughs> I don't make games, but I do... I don't know. <laughs> I have an opinion, I guess, even if I don't. Is that fucked up? Probably. Oh, cool, we platinumed it. That, oh, that was a combat. Okay. What is with that? Why is platinum better than gold? Isn't platinum just like a silver or white gold? I don't know. Do we do... Okay, we did okay. We didn't get the max tier, but that is the second max tier. I think it's four grade. Oh, um, you guys weren't with me, but there was a, uh, a new random encounter that I faced. It's essentially this chest, um, and it's titled as like a random event. Um, and this chest, you go up to it, unlock it, and then what happens next is actually really cool. It summons like a shit ton of enemies. It's almost like guarding. It's like a troll chest, I think it's what it's called. Um, and it's super rare for this event to take place, um, and you get it, and I got like four legendaries from it. Uh, most of them were crappy, because <laughs> I tried them out and etc, but also they were cluttering in my inventory. But did we complete the main quest? Because we should've. Because yeah, we just, we did like th th six, <laughs> um, what do you call it, encampments. No! Did I misread it? I must have misread it. Well, that's shitty. Oh, it's two missions, not to, oh. That's stupid. Why can't I just be encampments? Why do I have to do two full sets of those? I'm not complaining. It's just dumb. <laughs> okay. 
What's the next batch? Do we have to finally defend? Yeah, we can defend our we can defend our home. My my defense on my home was looking <laughs> pretty top notch. <laughs> But let's go ahead and jump back into another encampment. I'm sure are people doing that still as of our weapons Do I I think I want to upgrade this no we got everything for this the uh, energy and all that other stuff the damage is cool the crit chance is Okay, <laughs> it's not the best um, Oh shit. Are we ready to go? We are but I'm by myself. Maybe we should do a different one just to change things up plus we got too much steel Yeah, I really want to get this one to its next tier although a lot of you guys were saying don't evolve it Yeah, in order for me to get to the next tier. I'm going to have to evolve it Shitty <laughs> um, and you guys said to only do that want to get to the next area So it's not even worth me spending my points here. Yeah, I was about to say I'm maxed on this Do I have yeah see as soon as I evolve it? That's was that's what it's going to cost to make it um, which is this weird Blue vial and other things, um, but yeah, I guess we're gonna have to start that and hopefully people will join if not Then we'll just do two and just wait because <laughs> as long as we get bronze. We're okay It just said complete. I thought it said do two encampments it's like no do two encampment missions, which is a bit <laughs> It's a babe. No, because in their dialogue didn't they say just do encampments. It wasn't like do 20 <laughs> some encampments Ray, you, you are an like imposter you? as far as I'm concerned Right here's an idea. What if we just fill an encampment full of explosives and then we just burn them and like literal burning them It's like the explosives never actually get used It's not the most effective, but it would scare them and were make them question where our sanity is Which I feel like would put them off guard a little bit and you know is that a spider on my arm? I f it felt like it I had to kill one this morning, and I felt bad about it, but also get the fuck up away from me. <laughs> it is not happening to be near me. Also, I do think this game, I've never joined a game where it's like half done. So I definitely think, <laughs> it's pretty shitty. But I think the game works like, if we're like 10 minutes into the mission, I don't think it allows people to join in. Um, for whatever reason, maybe people, they don't want to make like the feeling of people joining and backing out and only trying to find games that are about to be completed. I don't think that's how it would work. <laughs> and also, it's shitty for the person that doesn't, like, I need to beat this and I'm waiting for someone to join and just because it's like, I, I need them now, <laughs> you don't understand, I'm not like waiting, like I need their help this instant, I don't know. I just kind of feel like I've never gotten a game where it's half, it's over, right? Which in like Destiny, in every other game I'm playing currently, that happens where I'm like, oh cool, I just got like in the back end of this Crucible match, um, with this multiplayer game, or this strike, and I'm like, oh cool. Gizmos and a cricket bat. Do I have anything specifically special? Um, oh, I do have this, which is fairly interesting. It's kind of like the, uh, do I have it on my character? I don't think I destroyed it. Where are you? It's like, uh, it's one of the first weapons we attain. It's uh, the firework launcher. Yeah, the firecracker. This thing is amazing. <laughs> it is solid. It's kind of a similar beat to this, the zapper. In fact, yeah, let's uh, mess around with that. We don't use our melee weapons because we're about to die. Or we, we die, like, real fast. <laughs> but, yeah. Wait. Let's not use it just yet. Because it's like an AoE weapon, by the way. <laughs> yeah, it's like a blaster that's an AoE weapon. Kind of exactly like the ray gun from Call of Duty. Uh, wait, nope. Alright, that didn't. But it also takes a little bit to reload. Ooh, I didn't mean to jump off. Oh, no, this is bad. This is not ideal. We're getting away from the encampment. Oh. Never mind, this gun sucks. <laughs> it's, a le oh, it's a purple, actually. But it's also an energy-based weapon, which energy, sh like, shells or plasma, sh whatever. <laughs> whatever it's called. Ooh, this is the perfect mo moment. Nope. nope. <laughs> didn't really do that great. Oh, jeez. Yeah, better off just using these weapons. And the shotgun, I don't want to use because this one's far better. Oh, we finally have a person in here. Thank God. I was really worried I wasn't going to be able to ha make it happen. Grenade and, um, not this weapon, this one. Shoot, damn it. <laughs> I hit the button. Like, if you switch to your weapon and then hit pull the trigger, it, like, locks up and doesn't do it, so you have to re-click. And that's enough time for you to get smacked in the mouth by a very obese person, which means they're strong. Sure. <laughs> sure, game. It's like a weird thing in video games. <laughs> Also, the fatter the enemy, the more health he has, <laughs> which never makes sense. Also, it shoots like seven bullets, which is why I was like, okay, not only is it an energy-based weapon, but on top of that, it eats it eats like double the ammo every time you shoot it, but now nah, it didn't drop anybody. <laughs> didn't do that well at all. There it is. Um, but yeah, I do think I will start employing the, uh, is that a spider? No, it's not. <laughs> um, I do think I will start employing uh, the, the strategy of just kind of playing the game at sun on my end, probably on the weekends, and just recording clip of like the dialogue portions, just so you guys get the story. 
Um, but again, I, the reason why I haven't been making videos that are like contained that I want on, I'd, I'd say I'd make them, um, is because it's way harder to like warrant that. Um, so for instance, I'm trying to level up my soldier so that I can make a video about the soldier class, um, specifically this type of soldier that plays off of this type of gimmick and etc. But it's real hard. It's real hard to level this person up to the point in which I can showcase most of, if not all of her abilities. Ow. <laughs> Ow. I got you. Just wait. I hope this is not too far away from the encampment. Ooh. War hurts. Sound like I said water <laughs> a little bit like an Is that an Australian thing? Is that a water? Water. It's like a certain type of way they say it. It's perfect. It's so it's amazing. <laughs> I like it. People are gonna be coming at me with like a boot in the comments and be like, I'm gonna be like, we don't say that. And they're gonna be like, neither do we. <laughs> we don't say water or whatever the hell you said. People get a hyper defensive about accents. Me especially, because God has the Canadian accent just been butchered. <laughs> it's like especially it's by like America, which we have no ill will towards, at least I don't think, based on our politics and etc but yeah <laughs> so it's just like why are you gonna make us look like an idiot <laughs> don't get me wrong they exist here but it's the same like no it's an even tinier portion of people than uh, people who are from like deep south and talk with like a heavy south southern <laughs> sorry accent but, like people being like oh that's the american way of speaking it's like no it's not <laughs> why are we getting into this right now Ooh, i forgot i need to survive Stupid, it's only those people, again, because they have, like, lock-on features, which, again, is weird because they've shown that, that, like, the baseball throwers have that mentality of you can dodge them, you can bounce around them. Okay, I'm good, I'm not gonna do any more. Uh, well, unless they're, like, pining for them, but I need, actually, I don't need wood. In that case, let me build all this. Yes, I get a game, I don't need planks. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I need to stand up straight. <laughs> Damn it. I was really good there for about like a week. I was just killing it. I wasn't like slouching, but now I've gotten back into it. Usually on stream is when I get like back into it and then throughout making videos, I'm just like, <laughs> I'll come help you, even though I don't think it's really worthy because we got seven minutes to do like seven <laughs> if you want to get max prestige on this. But hey, fucking don't, 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 don't make me go down. Don't make me go down. Don't, don't, just don't, 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 don't. If I step on this, I can walk off this. I can, I can just run. Come on, shield. Come on, shield. I don't care about this encampment. I don't really care about this encampment. Ooh, get behind something. Yep, fuck it. I'm not doing this. <laughs> I'm not doing this, dude. I do think the, uh, probably the strongest character is the one that has the, uh, lifesteal. Well, not strongest, because strengths can lie in different ways in this game, which is very cool. Um, they can, like, uh, more so than any game I'm playing currently. Like, you can have a builder that is structurally perfect around building bases and whatnot. I do think they need to crank that up, because thus far, the, like, the, uh, soldiers have the deepest gain for what they do i suppose so for instance um everyone can kind of build builders can build better yeah um, everyone can find loot but uh, scavengers can find it easier <laughs> but no one can kill like a soldier or a ninja ninjas and soldiers i think are the strongest classes because they have passives but also like their abilities are bonkers as well like the assassins can literally go like invisible and every time you reactivate a skill it like makes you it, it was something crazy like it reassigns stuff i don't know how to put it i talked to a person recently that it, it was kind of surprising to me they were saying that they they wouldn't pay full price for this game and i was surprised at that i did pay full price in fact <laughs> um i said that i think at the beginning where as the game is i'm i this would be enough for me you know what i mean like they didn't they would need to add all these updates to make it a thing um, it helps, and it's, it would definitely, this is not, like, the most, like, with the update that they made with, like, the, getting this weapon, whatever it's called, like, the super compressed weapons. On a side note, I am pretty worried about that, that's the only worry I have for the game, is they made Player Unknown Battlegrounds, uh, the Battle Royale is what it's called. Um, I'm not playing it again, I'm not sure if I will, I just, it's not my type of game mode. And, yeah, <laughs> but, uh, what do you call it? I, I'm not sure if I like the way they're going in terms of that. Very worried that that's the way they're going to be going with the game, is, like, just whatever the latest trend is, they're gonna jump on that thing's back and not focus on, like, the gun packs or whatever, like, the events, which I don't think is gonna be the case. I think for the next month, we'll have an event, and the month after that, we'll probably have another, another event. 
Oh, because I think next month is a Halloween-ish month, uh, so they made up have a Halloween update, which would be amazing. Especially if they have skins that really promote that, I would love that. I, but I do hope it's more they like they harp on the like the cool factor of Halloween skins, not like the Halloweeny aspects of that. Like if it shows our character like dressed up in like clearly a costume, it's like all right. <laughs> but if if it, one of our like the soldiers or the ninjas um, had like glowing red eyes and a mask on, that was a uh, I don't know what it's called. It's like a it's basically like the ghost equivalent of Japanese ghosts a yokai There we go like a yokai. I think it'd be really cool um, But just something that wouldn't immediately be weird if you've seen it outside of the veil of Halloween I'd want that for character skins and whatnot as of events. I just I trust The developer <laughs> to make whatever the hell we're gonna be grinding or doing that, that that's them all of its them <laughs> But still I think that'd be I don't have anything to contribute there. Yeah, we did the bare minimum there, but hey we did the quest. Let's let's leave. Shade level two chest. We got nothing. Pretty much. Yep. <laughs> I am so sorry. I would never send you out unprepared. <laughs> that was not funny, Pop. Commander, something's really wrong with Pop. <laughs> Pop's evil. I take it. <laughs> Is an evil bad man. Alright, Pop, just be cool. I'm just gonna take this call. Hello? I'm ready to get back in the broadcasting game. If you can find me a mic, a studio, and some watts, I'll bring in the survivors. You warm up those pipes, we'll fire up the airwaves. And then the next mission we'll be doing next time, guys, is the Radio Free Plankerton. Um, find, find five pieces of broadcast studio equipment in successful missions in a 23 zone. Let me reread that. Find five pieces of broadcast studio equipment in a successful five minutes. Okay. But does that mean, like, is it the one we just did? I don't, I thought it meant do two encampments, not two things. Like, does it want me to do five, 25, 23 level missions and find, uh, probably not. I don't think I'd do that for this. Anyways, uh, we're, after that, we're going to be doing the storm defense thing, which I can't see this taking too long unless it is, like, do five fucking missions in that case it probably still won't take long because I'll just do it in my time anyways um, Next time we're probably gonna be defending our base, which I don't think there's too much to update you guys on the base It's more or less the same the cube is the same This I think I showed you guys. This is more or less the same. That is more or less the same um, This is slightly different. Yeah, I just kind of made sure I've utilized these because these are amazing these like little dart launchers They're fantastic um, they're like the only reason we were able to get to get through the 14th day survival mission for to be able to get this gun. It sucks. Like I can't. I remember that again. I felt defeated. I never feel defeated after playing a video game. Oh, <laughs> um, it was bad. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, I don't think there's too much. I think I showed you guys this over here. It's the same same shit, different story. But I do think this is gonna snap immediately because they they spawn with like these things that are made to destroy your shit, which they don't tell you where those are going to be. Hence that debacle we had up there and we lost half our shit. Also, they said somewhere where your base is supposed to basically repair itself, but no go. <laughs> no go on that, which is weird. Um, repair itself after a time period, sorry. <laughs> um, anyways, uh, that brings us to the end of the video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching, as always. So, the subscribe button above me, two videos to my right. If you guys did like the videos, then check out those other ones. Um, yeah, uh, that brings us to the end of the video. Again, um, Fortnite may start to just be a, a compilement of clips. Um, basically I'll intro the video being like, hey guys, what's up? And then I'll show you all the clips of the story unfolding and after we did all the tedious missions. And then I probably will try to dial in on the defense missions and just when I'm bored <laughs> and want to make another video video and it's asking us to do a random mission. I'll take you guys along on that ride. Otherwise, expect some spin-off um, s videos <laughs> of Fortnite, like covering the soldier. Which I am desperately trying to get enough experience to level up and evolve for so I can truly showcase that character. And yeah. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching as always. My name is Logan Ender Frost. Bye-bye-bye-bye. Bye. -bye -bye -bye. Bye. <laughs>